Hello all. Right, I'm going to do a little talk about my helmet, that helmet, and uh, why I never used to wear one. Which really, I don't really know why I never used to wear one. I used to do a lot of mountain biking before I started road cycling. And uh, I've always been a fan of hats. I'm pretty much always wearing a hat. I've got loads of different hats and things. And uh, that used to be my head protection. It was just really about getting out and cycling. I never really used to think about wearing a lid or a helmet. Um, and many a time people used to say to me, why don't you wear one? Or, you, you know, I was just didn't really know what to say. It just, just didn't. Um, I went to a trip to the States a few years ago now and I bought a helmet then for that trip. Um, it was a cross-country mountain biking trip for quite a, quite a long time and I uh, was away for quite a few months and I uh, started getting into the you know the routine of wearing wearing it for that and I did actually have a big crash the first week I was over there ironically and I uh, kind of uh, didn't really uh, come off too well the lid so it done its job but when I came back off that trip um, <laughs> I, um, I stopped wearing a helmet again I know it's stupid eh you know, is, is there anything in here, you know? But since I started road cycling, um, I invested. Uh, everyone else obviously was wearing a helmet and uh, just comes part and parcel, I think. Um, you get used to it after a while. I think most people putting a helmet on their head, you look at yourself in the mirror and it just look like some huge, huge dome on your head, on your head and uh, it can look quite ridiculous. But you get over that. You know, they serve a purpose. They do what they do. I think if you're, um, you know, if you are going to hit a tree or, you know, cyclist versus versus car, depending on a uh, speed, you know, and how hard you are actually going to hit something, then, uh, you know, you're going to come off better or worse versus whether you've got a helmet on or not. You know, I think um, if your time's up, your time's up, that's it, unfortunately. But uh, there's many a time I've been wearing my helmet and you've gone and bumped your head against something and... Uh, it makes you think, you know, if that force has been three or four times as that, then uh, it's going to serve its purpose. Right, the lid I got here is a cask, Vertigo, in Team Sky colours, which they're not really fussed about, really. Um, they were doing them at half price. I think someone ordered uh, an incorrect amount for the shop, so uh, I was in the right place at the right time. And I do like the colour black and blue anyway, it's pretty cool. It goes with some other um, clothing and that I got on my bike. You've got a little dial on the back, like so. Leatherette chin straps with a buckle, like so. Um, you've got some two reflective stickers on the back of there, each side. And the chin straps have got reflect, um, reflective material down the sides there as well. You got about, I think it's 24 vents in the top of there, and you got little, like obviously little stickers each side, which is starting to pee a little bit, but to be expected. So yeah, to put this on, this is a size large. So you just place it on like so, and then dial it in on the back. So it's pretty tight, and then buckle up pretty comfortable I mean you know just routine now stick it on and uh, it's just great you know it keeps me air from swirling around <laughs> and uh, yeah you can wear like um, cycling caps underneath there bandanas ear warmers that's why I got the size I did I, I did um, squeeze into a medium but I thought it'd be a good idea to get the large because then you, you got a uh, flexibility then and you know you can wear shades with it I wear them inside or outside the straps depending on what I'm wearing underneath actually so you can do whatever with that. But yeah, definitely good investment. And uh, I don't know if it affects the way you're treated on the road. If car drivers, you know, react differently. I really don't know if there's anything psychologically going on with that. But uh, it'd be a strange one sometimes, you know, versus not wearing a helmet. People, you know, they react differently. It depends, you know. 
I'm, I'm all um, in pleased with that anyway. I mean, the other helmet I did have when I crashed was... Uh, I mean, I've crashed a bunch of times, unfortunately. Been hit off by cars numerous occasions. Smashed my jaws on the stem. Nah, it wasn't funny. It sounds funny, but it bloody hurt. And i uh, been hit off and rolled onto grass and things. I guess I've been lucky. I've always landed like a cat, you know? But yeah, the GT helmet I did, I did wear at the time. It, that took a big whack on the side. And, uh, you know, you just look at it and think that could have been your head, you know, that's just your skull, you know, your brain. <clears throat> so get a helmet, get your kids to start wearing helmets. As far as, you know, compulsory goes, I, I don't know, I reckon it will give people the choice, really. There's, there is... You know, in my opinion, there's so many rules and legislation around these days, you know, it's not as like you're being free to do what you want anymore. You're almost like, um, you know, you will do this, you know, or you get a heavy fine or something. I just think it should give people the choice. Definitely. You may make your mind up, you know. But for me personally, I like the old helmets now. They look cool as well. You can have one for each day of the week if you wanted, couldn't you? <laughs> So anyway, yeah, I hope that's given people a little bit of an idea. Wear a helmet, go and get yourself a helmet. Plenty of colours out there, and, you know, for kids and stuff, they've got these different little funky designs and stuff. You see, you can attach stuff to them. I've got a little light on the front of mine. A little bit of a Velcro thing going on the back of there. Sometimes I, um, I'll put my shades on there like that, just to keep them out of the way. Because I've stuck them on the front there before, and they fell out or whatever. But anyway, that's just me. There you go.